value holders the value holders section contains the controls that offer value lists such as combo box or list box as well as controls where the user can make interactive choices on data selection like checkbox or radio button group simple controls with input functions can be categorized under value holders section few examples we'll discuss such as combo box and checkbox for the combo box the constructor is sap.ui.commons.combo box and belongs to a class sap.ui.commons.combo box and for creating a new combo box the code you have to write is new space sap.ui.commons.combo box the important properties for combo box is max pop up items display secondary values selected key selected item id the event is change event is fired when the text in the field has changed and the focus leaves the combo box or the enter key is pressed in addition all settings applicable to the base type sap.ui.commons.txt field can be used as well let's see an example and as we know that all sap ui5 applications structure consists of bootstrap section and ui area that is body section in common we shall ignore writing these sections from now on so directly we are going to the second script block of sap ui5 application structure where the application we will define that is defining the ui elements which we need for our application so we are creating a combo box so the new space sap dot ui dot commons dot combo box is the constructor for creating a new button and the name of our combo box is o combo box and for this the tooltip is country and whether it is editable yes true and the value which we set in the combo box is deutschlan so when we see the result in the browser we can see the value deutschlan in the combo box and width is 200 pixel now the other values or the items in the combo box we have taken the country 1 as canada country 2 as deutschlan which already we have set as a value default value in the combo box and country 3 as england country 4 as india now we attach this combo box to the ui area so the id content which we have mentioned here now check result in browser move cursor on value holder to see tooltip that is country and you can see the default value as deutschland expand value holder and check values coming to checkbox as you can see the constructor is sap.ui.commons.checkbox and belongs to a class sap.ui.commons.checkbox for creating new checkbox the constructor you have to write is new space sap.ui.commons.checkbox the important properties are checked text enabled editable value state width text direction and name the event is changed event is triggered when the control status is changed by the user by flagging or unflagging the checkbox in addition all settings applicable to the base type sap.ui.core.control can be used as well coming to example the application section so creating a simple checkbox we are written the constructor and text is i want to receive the newsletter 
tooltip is newsletter newsletter checkbox and we have checked it true yeah as you see the result in the browser you can see the checkbox is checked already and the function the event change we have taken the function we have written as alert if checked yes or unchecked then the alert will be no so we are attaching this element to the ui area so the same id content we have taken now you can see the result in the browser so if you move cursor on checkbox you can see the tooltip that is newsletter checkbox and it is already checked as you can see uncheck checkbox and see alert as no these are about value holders in the next video we will see the complex controls thank you